guess what? What? It is I, Rubex. <laughs> Today we are jumping in Glory Invictus. I'm here with some of the devs. We have Yogg as well as Bartold. So I guess uh, to get things started, this is live. Uh, Yogg, uh, hello my friend, hello. Hello everyone, my name is Jan Gruchowski and I am co-owner of Glory Invictus. As we are the indie team, we are doing uh, a lot of things, not only the main ones, as I've started as sound designer and musician. Uh, and now I'm also doing some of the basics of coding, uh, supporting, moderating forum and a lot, a lot of, of another stuff. And there's also Bartosz Idzikowski, uh, he's our writer, uh, he's, he started as a writer but now he's also a designer. And, and he's responsible for our crafting. Honestly, I, I just have to admit that I really, really like our community at this moment because someday, about, maybe that was yesterday even, uh, I vlogged got... into the game and uh, I was fully equipped by some random people they didn't even know that was me. And... Uh, well, that's, <laughs> that's awesome. Uh... So basically, if you will open your map, you will uh, click the M button. You will find... Uh, there are the few, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I I six, six, six no. flags to which you can capture not. at this moment, uh, which is one of the, I think, coolest features in our game, uh, since it's basically a territory fight. Uh, after you will take it, you, you have you gain access to the best resources, uh, your NPC guards will spawn here and defend it. Unique shops with other yeah. items. Later, player will be, players will be able to, to, to fortificate those. It's an uh, end game at this moment. <laughs> and it's but, quite important as almost all of items available in the game uh, can be crafted or have to be crafted. So, access to resources is... Uh, the mother here. Yes, uh, our game is non-target basis, so you need to shoot off your weapon and clicking the F button. Let's take a try. Great, it works. And our game is based on uh, directional attacks. So, so basically, you can do attacks from left to right, from right to left, overhead and stuff. So it's yeah. something. Like Mountain Blade, I would say. That's that's the game we are focusing. From what I know, the Midlanders are doing the second party to con counter us. So. Those are heavy. I like that this guy has like a bear skin for a helmet or something. He's a he's like a yeah, barbarian. Can, That's great. You you can kill savages in, in the swamps and. Sometimes they drop the recipe for those helmets so you can craft it uh, like any other item in the game because nearly, nearly all of the items are player. And, and as you can see, I wear the full cap on my back. Okay, so at this moment we are taking control over the flag because we've killed all the guards. It was quite easy because it's uh, a small, small flag, and there were there were no another nation players defending it. But I think it will get harder soon. <clears throat> okay, and now you, if you have a pickaxe, you can uh, go and collect some sources over there. Oh, 
Oh, I see we've split with our party. Let's wait for them a second. Okay, they're coming. If you will look forward, you will see uh, the keep. I see someone. Let's. Doors can be another players. Okay, okay, okay. Those are midlanders. So, it's gonna be funny. This was a pretty weak party. You can try to loot them now. You have only 30 seconds, so. A button. Yeah, you need to take off your weapon and try. And to... you have to choose item you want to. There are different weathers and even seasons in our game. So basically. Sometimes there, there is even a winter when it uh, gets snow and the snow fall over the place. Uh, I think it's quite unusual in the most of the MMORPGs to, 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 to make different seasons and, and weathers. Okay, we are getting closer. It's, we might find some guards in here. Okay, there are no guards. We are lucky at this moment. Yet. Yet. Okay. So, I think we need someone with a good shield. Okay. Bartol, will you go? I can go, but wait a while. I think I see someone in the city. Up. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> okay, <laughs> now I see Morgan is someone. Okay, Morgan is here. Come on, come on! Take melee weapon, come on! Whoa! Watch out! Take care of the gun, it's very, very hard. Oh crap. Me. I don't know if he can stand this. We both died, so <laughs> I, I hope watching. you you will be able to. Okay, great. If you will okay. kill everyone, we could take the flag, and we will be able to respawn. You guys, it's now to. I need to kill all the NPCs.
Do you get experience for killing actual players of the enemy faction? Uh, not yet. We, uh, we will be adding this feature soon. Uh, at this moment, you can only loot him. You get this in the side. We'll try again then. <laughs> oh, that's, that's run, nice. run for your life. Oh, help, help, <laughs> help me. <laughs> Whoa, oh, <that's>... boy. <laughs> okay. So we'll meet in the village. <laughs> yeah, I think we should. Short bow, reflex bow, and the long bow. It's, they have different armor penetrations and they shoot uh, in the different distances. For me to do more damage with this bow, I need to get my dexterity up, right? I mean, that would help. Both dexterity uh... and strength. Dexterity will help you to uh, make harder critical strikes, uh, mostly, and strength is the pure damage at this moment. Gotcha. Anyway, dexterity is uh, adding some uh, percentage of damage oh, to okay. the bow. Damage. Yeah, yeah, gotcha. But and critical strike. Dex is secondary uh, statistic for bow damage. Okay, you see, there's gotcha. another strength player is a primary. Party. Okay, so basically, we've got our asses kicked down, so, so we could try taking another easier flag or taking the, the same again. Mm -hmm. I think we can try to go to the western uh, mine. Okay. Maybe to the western farm later. Okay, if we get lucky we could find them out and attack the main city. Let's try that. Okay, uh, speaking about combat basics, uh, as you realize, I think uh, we have a uh, stamina bar, the yellow one. It's uh, responsible for your ability to attack, block, or sprint. And so, uh, its uh, stamina management seems to be uh, very important at the moment. When you have uh, very little or no stamina, your attacks will be weaker. Oh, thank you. Oh. On your back. Ah. Ah. Oh, yeah. stop, stop. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> As your level is lower than, than ours, they, they try to hunt you down. As we are moving forward, I could tell you about one of the features I really, really like as a RPG player. Um, some of the enemies uh, and all of the NPCs can talk. Uh, not only some random stuff, but but they they talk about the things which are uh, taking place on the uh, on the game world. So basically, if uh, there is a foggy weather, they could talk about it. If you would take uh, control over the flag, the NPCs will recognize you as the one who took the control over the territories. Okay, so this flag is ours. Let's proceed.
What? I see. And we... Ah, if there's no shield, I need to do... Oh, the Go guard around. is running to them. Okay. Who's rushing? So when are you guys making the switch to the Unity 5? Is that going to be next week? Or you're going to start working on it next week, right? Oh, we are working on it already for a few weeks. And Got it. I think we'll finish in, I don't know, two weeks maybe. Gotcha. It's, we will see when we, it will get into our testers. I'm just, I'm very impressed with what you guys have. This is awesome. Really fun. Graphically, it's nice. Everything is really put together well. One of the biggest parts of the game is the crafting, which could be hard to show you. There are more than 500 recipes at this moment. Okay. Let's try to find them. So you just take the flag by standing around it, right? In the in the area. Yes. Does it does the flag go down faster if you have more people, or is, does it matter? 
it doesn't matter but it only goes down if every of the enemy uh, npc and player is dead in the arena okay okay it's ours already great the flags also give a big boost of exp okay so we are going to take the control over the farm as there are mostly peasants only here it's gonna be quite easy and we are be going near the their mine city which will be very deadly for us <laughs> let's hope we can stand it you can ride the mine city but there's many of the guards there are archers and they respawn very quickly, so you need to gather um, three or four parties most of the time to take control over the city. And still, you won't hold for long. Okay, just a process. One down. This one. This one. Oh, okay. Four Midlanders. Two enemies more, it says. Okay, let's go. So let's try the eastern gate. Yeah, let's let's get together as the guards might might attack us anytime if they spot us. Just the bad guards. Oh, okay, I see someone there. Let's take a group. There are Milanders. Whoa. I think he just headshot me. Are you ready to rush in with me? Yep. Yeah, let's come, come here, uh, to the right, let's flank them. Maybe they won't see why the bar pushes. Yeah. Let's, let's, let's get in the other bags. Okay, okay. Someone saw us, okay. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter, just Don't rush. sprint, don't sprint. Okay. I'm attacking this one. <laughs> they didn't solve it. Great. Okay. Oh! I think I might die. Hold, hold. I'm blocking. I'm running back. Take care of guard, guards. Four guards are right here. Okay. Run, with her. run, 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 run. <laughs> Okay, 
Yeah, those, those guards are the strongest in game, so... Uh, <laughs> well, it's been a hell of a run. Really enjoying myself. This has been a lot of fun. The PvP and, and just the graphics, uh, the music, uh, the visuals. Haven't even touched the crafting yet. Apparently you can craft over 500 recipes. Uh, looks like they're going to be switching to Unity 5 in a couple weeks, which is going to give them the opportunity to make and add a bunch of new features. This is again pre-alpha. This is very early still in development. I think the one exciting thing that Yogg was telling me is that once they have Unity 5 up and running, there's going to be the possibility for naval battles, naval ship combat. So that is going to be uh, pretty cool to see what happens with that regard. I'm hooked. I'm loving this game. I'm jumping back in this game when I'm done editing down this video. Very fun times in Glory Victus. Thanks again to the guys and the dev team for hanging out. I'm hooked. Again, gonna be uh, jumping back in this game. I want to level my guy up a bit more and get to that point where I can actually do some damage to these uh, damn guards that have so much HP. This is open world, territorial based conquest, PvP, manual blocking and attacking with a huge crafting system already in place. This is pre-alpha. I'm excited to see these new features coming in the next couple weeks weeks. Very cool indeed. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below, and I will see you next week. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out!